Hello guys, so I know it's been a while since I made a video for you guys. So I just want to give you an update on what's been happening and the reason I've been off YouTube for a while. So before we get into that, if you're new to the channel, my name is Katleo. I'm a software software developer. And on this channel, I share some tips and my experience of how I became a software software developer in order to help you guys get motivated, get inspired, and also make it easy for you guys to get into the field. So if that sounds interesting to you guys, make sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel, and hit that bell icon so you're notified whenever I release new content. All right, let's get right into it. So the main reason I've been off YouTube for a while is because at my current job, there was a transition that was going on. So there were a lot of projects that needed to be done within a specific period. So I needed to focus all my efforts on getting that done. So I've not been doing some of the things that I usually do because I needed to get those things done. So I've been focusing mainly on building those projects. And the reason actually why I'm actually making a video right now is because I was able to get those projects on time. So that's the reason why right now I have a lot of free time. So that's why I'm able to make videos. So from now on, I'll actually be making one video a week or at least two for you guys so that I can help you guys get that job or actually help you guys learn new skills and give you more information on my experience and give you guys some tips on what to do in whatever situation you might be in as you're looking for a job or learning a new skill right so just to give you more information about the whole project thing we were basically using angular for the application right so everything was created using angular right so they needed to move to react because the team wants to use react because as you know react is popular and it has a lot of support and also it has a lot of things that you can do specifically for what we were building right so we needed to move from angular to react so we needed to build the whole application on react and also we needed to build some more features on react that's why we actually moved to react because some of the features that we needed to build we're not going to be built nicely if we used Angular, if we kept using Angular. So we needed to move to React. So that's the main thing that we were doing. So we were basically building the whole application from scratch in React. And this is a big, big application. There are a lot of things that's going on over there. So there are a lot of moving parts. So we needed to actually focus on getting this right because the clients need an application that's running, right? And they needed those features. So those features were very urgent. So we needed to build everything from scratch in React. So that's the reason why I've been off YouTube because I was working on that whole project, that whole transition, right? So right now we are basically still running the Angular version, but also we have the React version where it has all those features that they needed. So the Angular version has its own purpose, then the React version has its own purpose, right? So basically we're running the two applications on different frameworks, right? I actually like the transition because using React, like it makes things easy. And I'm a person who has been using React throughout my whole learning journey. So I've mainly been using React. I only learned Angular when I started working at the company. So everything that I've been doing, I've learned at the company. So yes, you can learn a new skill at the company. You don't need to have everything on your CV that you know, but at least I had React experience. So they know that if you have React experience, obviously it will be easier to transition to another framework, right? Yeah, they knew that. So that's why they gave me an opportunity to get on the team because they know that I have the expertise. So just to give you some of the tech that we're using on the React version, we're using React as the main thing, but we're actually running Next.js, right? So Next.js just makes things easy. So that's the main reason why we chose to go with Next.js instead of just using React then having to put everything from scratch. So Next.js, it has a lot of things that are built in, so it just makes things easy to work with applications, right? So yeah, we have Next.js, which is built on top of React. Then also we're using Tailwind with CSS. So we're using those two for the CSS and everything because Tailwind just makes things easy if you want to build applications much faster and also it takes into consideration the whole responsiveness of your application so you don't have to do much about the responsiveness then when it comes to the ui we're using shared cn which is something like bootstrap or material ui so we chose shared cn because it has the components that we need 
to build the features that we needed to build. And also the application that we were already running on Angular has some of the things that can be built using ShareCN. So it'll, it was going to make things easy to build the whole application. So we're using ShareCN for the UI components. Then yeah, the rest is just add-ons. So it's just libraries that we needed to build a specific feature. So there are a lot of libraries obviously that we're using but those are the main ones that we're using to run the whole application so yeah that's gonna do it guys i just wanted to give you guys a brief update on what's been going on and the reason why i've been off youtube for a while so right now i'll be posting videos every week once or twice a week so yeah i'll try to stay consistent for you guys so that i can help as many of you guys to secure that next job or to help you guys through the process of learning a new skill in tech so yeah that's gonna do it guys thank you guys so much for watching this video make sure you subscribe to the youtube channel and hit that bell icon so you get notified whenever I release new content and also don't forget to like the video guys thank you so much for watching this video have a nice day catch me on the next one